Hello everyone, welcome to Apache Edge format videos for developers, Drupal developer portal series. In this video, we're going to see the power of uh, Drupal out of the box uh, modules in developer portal. Prerequisites for this video, you need Apache Edge account and uh, you need Apache Edge Drupal based developer portal uh, with an admin access. In this video, we're going to see uh, how to leverage Drupal uh, contributed modules that comes out of the box with Apache Developer Portal and uh, enable new features on Developer Portal with ease. Let's get started. As you can see here, uh, I'm logged in as a Drupal uh, administrator and I can see the Drupal admin menu on top of the screen. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate uh, how to leverage uh, Google reCAPTCHA uh, feature and uh, prevent uh, bot attacks uh, uh, when it comes to accessing the forms, various forms in developer portal. Uh, to enable the reCAPTCHA module, go to modules. Once you are in that page, you will see various modules that Apache developer portal out of the box ships with developer portal. As you can see, there are many modules. Some of them are enabled, uh, some of them are disabled, and uh, some of them has a uh, dependency with other modules. As you can see, Drupal developer portal ships with a ton of modules that uh, gives various features. For example, if you see the high level categories, there are access control modules that gives uh, uh, administrator uh, screens using which you can able to control individual access to the content like blogs, forums, or even smart docs when it comes to API documentation. So there are a ton of modules available out of the box with developer portal, and you can leverage all these modules based on your requirement. Today, we are going to see a simple use case where we're going to do a spam control using reCAPTCHA module. To enable the module, either you can search reCAPTCHA uh, from uh, the search uh, bar on top of the screen. Once you find the module, just enable the module and click on save configuration. Once you save uh, the module, you need to do a little bit of configuration to make the module work. So reCAPTCHA module has a dependency of the CAPTCHA module. So we are going to enable the CAPTCHA module as well. Just click on continue. So once you're done, uh, you can use the configurations button next to the module to configure the module. Or you can refer to readme file inside the module uh, folder uh, to find out how to configure the module. For example, I have the readme.txt of a reCAPTCHA module in RPG source code uh, of the Drupal developer portal. You can able to see how to do the configuration. Uh, so you need to enable the reCAPTCHA module that we have done and uh, we need to go to configuration screen where you can where we can configure the reCAPTCHA module settings. We need to register the website at the Google reCAPTCHA to get the keys. So I'm going to do that. So I'm going to go to that particular URL. So in the meantime, navigate to the configuration screen the upper portal where you will configure the keys that you get from Google reCAPTCHA. And there's some widget settings where you can choose the themes and other things. So I'm going to la label it as Apache 4 mv 40 demo site. And I'll choose reCAPTCHA v2. And I'll give the domain name, which is dev iPhone 4MV40. I'll accept the terms of services and click on register. Once I register, I'm going to get the keys. As you can see, site key and secret key. I'm going to copy these keys uh, to my developer portal and save settings. So once it is done, you can enable the reCAPTCHA uh, spam control uh, feature on different forms. You can able to do that on CAPTCHA settings. So click on CAPTCHA. You will see various forms and you can able to choose the form on which you want to enable the spam prevention control. Let's say I want to enable this on user uh, login or even user register form. So I'm gonna choose reCAPTCHA, the uh, CAPTCHA type, and I'm gonna click on save configuration. Now, if I go to registration screen, I should see the reCAPTCHA uh, validation. So I have opened the site in an incognito mode. And if I click on register, I should see a reCAPTCHA form that will validate uh, uh, the users. There you go. And now I have a, I'm a robot uh, control where I can able to uh, choose uh, the validation things, right? So that's how you can able to quickly leverage RPG uh, uh, Drupal modules and you can able to get the desired feature with uh, with few minutes, within a few minutes. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Uh, if you like these videos, please subscribe to YouTube channel to get notified whenever there is a new 4 minute videos for developers. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to post your questions in community.apg.com. Thank you for watching this video.